SimLab and also what it looks like when my assisting vlog that's microbio. I'll be able to pop into SimLab. So if you watched the last vlog, this is picking up directly where that one ended. It's about seven right now. I have a meeting for AO to log on to, kind of planning for fall semester. And then I'll show you all a calendar and my upcoming plans for the week so you kind of know what to expect in this video. Okay, it's the next day. I didn't end up filming anything last night. And honestly, I'm really happy about it. I think you all will be too because I just literally sat in the living room with my roommates from like 8.30 until like 11.15. And if you've seen past videos, you know that I was very excited to live here and I felt like it was going to be a really good social environment and a really good opportunity to get to know people better and everything. So that's a positive for us, I think. One of my roommates is as the president and I'm on the core exec with her and I plan the lunch and learns as well as honestly, like I help a lot with other events from companies so whether that's like the tailgate sponsorships or socials networking events that they want to host as well as lunch and learns so we were kind of going over a lot of ideas for that and drafting up new emails to send to different dental service organizations which are basically like corporate chain dental offices that love to sponsor things as well as i'm trying to bring in at least a decent amount of private practice or residencies, GPRs, it seems like our members are most interested in general dentistry. So um, over the next couple weeks for the rest of fall semester, I'm gonna be doing some research into more people that could possibly speak on those topics. And I also had that executive board meeting for AO last night as well. So that's kind of what's been going on. And I just filled out a membership for Planet Fitness because the campus gyms are a little bit of a walk now rather than right across the street. I'm excited about Planet Fitness. I went in undergrad at Michigan State, but I haven't been since I graduated. I canceled my membership and everything, so I'm excited to go back today. I have a few errands to run. We don't have any in-person activities. This is today's schedule. Right now it's 9.15, and we technically have a class at 1, 2, and 4, and then I have Bible study at 5.30. And as I mentioned a little bit later, I will go through my schedule with you all for the week and we'll do some planning and I'll also let you know how things are going with any in-person activities which is SimLab and also on Friday you'll get to hear about our first complete dentures lab. This week is just based on me having two assists I signed up for with my friend so I had to assist this Wednesday following my schedule of assigned things and then Thursday was an extra that I just said yes to. We have to assist 20 times this semester and as you can see there's a lot of extracurricular stuff going on this week but basically our classes, we just have class Monday and Tuesday are most of our lectures. Like I said, Monday, Wednesday, Friday are our sim lab in-person activities. Every Friday we have a quiz in person with that class as well. And our 8 a.m. endo class is synchronous, so live Zoom. And we have a quiz every other week in that class. This is the best representation of what the schedule looks like when my assisting isn't in there. Um, this is just one assigned assist, grad perio assist. Yeah, that's kind of what can be expected. All I've put in so far is are midterm and practical for this denture class. I haven't put in any midterms and finals yet for my other classes, but that's on my to-do list for today as well so that when I'm planning future things with friends, family, visits and stuff later in the semester, I know when I should be studying and when I can kind of be extra free. Just past 4 p.m. my video is almost done exporting then it's gonna take a bit to upload we'll see how the Wi-Fi does this will be my first time posting a video from here I wanted to show some house updates and then I'm also about to have a little snack I ate lunch earlier and then we have Bible study at 5 30 right outside the dental school so I'm gonna drive over there drive my roommate with me and another one of my roommates is actually gonna come for her first time tonight as well but she's gonna meet us there because she'll be inside the dental school and then I think I'm gonna tell my friend to come over around 8 that way I have 
from like 6.40 until 8 to get a little bit more work done, as well as right now, I'll probably try to get something off my to-do list for today. The video took longer than I thought, and I was enjoying having a day to just run errands and kind of hang out, so I know I'll have plenty of time to catch up, if you will. I just need to watch a diagnostic sciences lecture that has a quiz due next week. I have to watch the GI lecture for this week, so I think the first one's an hour, and then I have a 45 minute lecture to watch for dentures, which is gonna have a quiz on Friday, so I definitely need to do that one, and I definitely need to do the diagnostic one. Again, because there's an associated assignment. If I don't get to GI till next week, it's not a big deal because there's nothing I have to turn in right away. And then I also have to do yesterday's perio lecture that I mentioned in the last vlog. That's microbio for perio, which perio is like your gum tissue, bones, like the support systems for your teeth, kind of like the ones that keep everything in place, give your teeth a nice hug, make them nice and strong so you don't lose your teeth from either periodontitis or from mobility issues where your teeth fall out. So we're gonna learn about the different bacteria in the oral microbiome. I'm gonna show you guys the most updated version of my room. I think it looks the same. You can tell me if this looks the same or not. I got most of the stuff out there put away. I haven't done this big pile yet. These magnets are so fun. And if you haven't already seen, I have a little tray for my rings and stuff. I usually keep my glasses here when I put my contacts in in the morning. Some plants, a little jar of scrunchies, two storage bins, and then a bunch of my books. This area is the same. I think the matte print will go up there and then most of my other wall art will go on that portion of my bed and then some will go on top of my dresser and what i'm excited to show is living room so bar cart still needs to be assembled anna's almost done putting away all her stuff so that's great they brought this table which is really fun we have a few speakers so that's for as to events like same shelf kind of going here i think that one's anna's the big couch with the rug out and the tv stand and I think we're gonna get little placemats for this and then the bar cart will go right there with a print above it. I think it's gonna look very nice. I also got a cute welcome mat at Target today and picked up cleaning supplies for the downstairs bathroom because that's kind of gonna be my responsibility if I'm the one using it. So that was another errand I ran after Planet Fitness today. So that was kept me out of here until like one and then I did the video, ate lunch, and now we're here. Morning, it's Wednesday. I'm eaten some breakfast and then I'm going to head in to assist at 11 and then we have sim lab at 2 so those are going to kind of run right into each other assuming that the appointment goes the full time at 11 kind of hoping we get done right by 1 that way I have a minute to eat a snack before sim lab and I'm also assuming that sim lab will be pretty short because we're just taking alternate impressions I don't know how many retakes are gonna make us do, what the criteria and stuff is on the type of dance, but I would imagine that it's not gonna to be too tough since we've already had Algernon Impressions Lab last semester. for the evening I'm just about to use some essential oils in my diffuser to have a little cozy vibe and turn off the lights and everything happy Thursday I'm just in the process of cooking some breakfast and putting together my coffee here so I saw that Michelle Reed on YouTube uses almond milk coconut whipped cream on her 
coffee to make it more like Starbucks vibes. So I'm just gonna put some almond milk and this whipped cream on here for my morning coffee. And then I'm saving a bit and gonna put it in the fridge to have an iced coffee tomorrow or even maybe tonight, depending. But I just straightened my hair because I need to take a couple pictures. One I have to take for an Instagram giveaway that is going up on September 6th, so Monday from the week after I'm recording this. So I'm gonna try to take both of those this morning before I leave as well. It's already 9.15 and I have to be at the school by like 10.45 at the latest. We have a live Zoom at 10. Our 9 a.m. class this week was just a recording, but going forward, it'll be a live class. It was just like an introduction to the course. And then the 10 a.m. class is a Zoom reviewing our lecture that we were supposed to watch before then. So I'll probably listen to that as I'm walking to school, just because I'm not gonna be ready in time to leave in like 20 minutes to get to the school before 10. And like I said, I wanna get those pictures done while my hair is still down before it's like up and sweaty from walking and clinic and everything. And then once I get to school, I'm assisting from 11 until two. And then at 2.30, I'm selling wristbands and hopefully in between the two, I'll be able to pop into SimLab. And yesterday you saw that we were doing alternate impressions of our typodonts. So we had to do an upper and lower impression for our practical typodonts, as well as our SimLab typodonts, which are the same. You just usually designate one of your three for SimLab and then save the other for practicals. That way equilibrium and occlusion doesn't really get messed up because you don't use it as often is kind of the thought process. So we took the alternate impressions and then we had to pour them up with microstone as far as I got and I need to go into lab to take the alginate and the microstone apart. What I need to do next is trim that model on, on a machine. Eventually I'll get a clip of it for you. You wet it, you trim it, make sure the base is nice and flat. By the end of the next session on Wednesday, I think we're supposed to have our stents made. So I have to make a stent of all four of those casts. Um, and it's just for one quadrant on each of those. And I'm trying to go to the gym after the wristbands are done at 3.30. I'll walk back here, it'll be around four. And then I'm going to try to go to the gym before a meeting that I have at 6.30, the AAWD executive board meeting, I'm the VP of that and we have a lot of planning to do. So the 6.30 meeting, I wanna be sitting at my laptop, not at the gym. But this is a little behind the scenes. I have this tripod for my phone. Grew my phone in with the big camera and it just has a little remote. This also probably seems like a lot of work, but it's only because I have to do a giveaway photo. So that I'm gonna do at the desk, I believe. And I'm gonna like have their program pulled up on my laptop. Usually my Instagram pictures are thumbnails from videos. So they're pictures on this real camera, my Sony camera. So it's stuff that I had to do anyway. Charming 
sitting on my workout mat. I ended up working out here after I got back from school because I was just gonna do a workout plan PDF that I have anyways, so I figured I didn't need to go to the gym for that. I showed you all some of the wet lab, which is the part where you make adjustments to prosthetics for sim lab, so that's what a wet lab is, um, because certain materials, like the impression material, alginate is wet, I guess is the name, and then it obviously hardens and everything, but I did a little bit of adjusting the models just so that I could get all of the alginate out, and I'm gonna go back sometime before Wednesday to fix the rest of them and finish it all up, and I'll definitely make sure I vlog that. It'll be probably in the next video though, but wristband sales are done for the tailgate on Saturday. And then I have a couple things left on my to-do list. So I just wrote some stuff on my phone. Um, I have to finish our lecture for dentures, which we have a quiz in tomorrow. I have to study for that quiz. And then I have about a 30 minute ortho lecture to watch that has a homework assignment embedded in it. So that'll probably take me about an hour for each of those. And then I'll spend the rest of the evening studying. Lab is at 9 a.m. tomorrow. better than expected. I mean, I wasn't too nervous, but you never know with the first quiz. Fairly straightforward. It was all stuff covered directly in the lecture. I got a four out of five on it. So, I mean, not perfect, but totally happy with that. And you saw a little bit of my walk home. I got Starbucks. During the lab, we were just checking that all of the parts of our articulator worked. We had to talk to a faculty and get it signed off that we knew how to work all the different parts that got it in the proper settings, calibrations. There's a bunch of different like degree angles and all the different parts that need to be set to something specific. And then we also had to show them that we know how to use the face bow. So I did that as well. And I got that signed off and then I had to go through my drawers, look at our checklist for that class for dentures to make sure I had all of the supplies that I need to be able to do the actual denture fabrication. So once I got all of that done, I just had to go downstairs to get one instrument that was missing. And then I was able to go home and now I'm here. So I'm back here and it's only 11 right now. I'll probably make lunch in a little bit. We're just gonna fill out like the security deposit checklist thing for our house of anything that was like missing or not working and then bring that over to the leasing office since it's been about a week since we've been here and the rest of today I'm just going to be catching up on school stuff from the week that way I can go into the long weekend relaxed and able to just have fun and not think about school as much as possible. So it's going to be the end of this week's video. I hope you all enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next vlog. Bye.